Hello, thank you for joining me. This is our second film in our series on decals, adding decals, making decals. Uh, we put a decal in our first uh, video, and we uh, went ahead and erased that. We're going to put it in here again, but let me show you what the end result of this is going to be ultimately. So if we go to uh, our retemp folder, uh, I already have an image that's already I've already made of a completed project. You can see what the decals look like ultimately. These are all the menu boards or the sign boards that I created, and I put uh, the big menu on this one, the smaller menu on that one. And a couple uh, comic icons, uh, Homer Simpson and his donuts, and some various images that uh, kind of complement that. So, you know, ultimately that is your goal is to dress up your project so that when you do photo real renderings of it, it actually really looks good. Except for this midget door here. We only have dwarves that serve donuts in this town. So, let's go ahead and close this out. Minimize that, and let's put in some more uh, more decals. So, decal. We've already done decal type, so let's go ahead and place decals. Let's start with this one, and let's put in our menu. So I'm going to start with the lower left-hand corner. Show you how to edit this. Escape a couple times. We're going to go ahead and stretch this out and try to fill up the rectangular area of our signboard. And let's go ahead and change the dimensions on that. Maybe six foot eight, six space eight will do. Now shrink down that. Uh, the rectangular signboard a little bit and it'll fit our decal just a little bit better. So another way of doing this is to go ahead and put the decals in all at once and make all your modifications to, decal, to the decals a second time. So let's go back to the insert, please decal, and I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to start from my very top and just put in all my donut decals. You want to make sure that when you put in your decals that you're actually hitting you know, the planar surface that you want to put them on. So right now I'm hitting uh, the back plane of my signboard every time I do this. There's a reason why I'm not trying to put them on the side here, because I'm likely, if I do that, I'm going to click on the frame, and it will sit on that frame, and it won't sit in the middle there. So we'll do Homer 1 over here. That would be a good place for him. <coughs> Pardon me. Menu 1. I think we did uh, Menu 1 before. Let's go ahead and do Menu 2. Plant that in the corner here. Now that we have all these planted, let's go ahead and adjust them. You can adjust your menu boards as you see fit, or you can take your decals and move those around. So let's put Homer right in the corner, stretch them out, arrow keys, move them up. Let's put him in the corner, stretch it down, and menu key or arrow keys, move them up a little bit. Let's do one more decal too, to show you that you don't necessarily have to limit yourself to the signboards that we have. You can put them on walls and display cases and other things. So if you go to insert, it's just as one last uh, uh, bit of illustration here. Let's go ahead and put uh, maybe Homer 3 back here with his donut. We'll put it over here and maybe in front over here as if some sort of promotional poster for the restaurant. So that's pretty much it. You saw the rendering uh, of the decals ultimately in a photo real rendering of, uh, of a camera view. And uh, yeah, dress up your project. Decals work out really well. It's like that final last detail that really helps dress up your project. Thank you for joining me. We'll see you in some other films.